So for um, number eight, we're given the parallelogram uh, in here in figure 1.1, where the diagonal is V plus W. So V plus W is this diagonal here. And then it wants us to find the other diagonal, which goes from here to there. So how can we think about this diagonal here? Well, we can think of it as being the tip to tail addition, right, um, of V and W. So if we think of W going from the origin to here, and then us doing uh, tip to tail addition, going W plus this green one, we're going to end up with the with this yellow vector as a resultant, which is vector V. So what we have here is that W plus the diagonal is equal to vector V. And so if we think about isolating the diagonal, we have that the diagonal is just going to be equal to V minus W, right? So we have found the first diagonal. So let me write that. The diagonal is uh, V minus W. And then it wants us to add uh, V plus W and V minus W, which are the two diagonals. So the sum is going to be the diagonal that we found plus the other diagonal here, which is plus V plus W. And so that is going to give us, uh, it's going to give us two V. And so now they want us to draw that vector sum. So I'm going to uh, erase all these arrows. And basically what we're gonna do here is um, tip to tail addition. So if this is my diagonal, what I'm gonna do here is just move it to the origin so I can do my tip to tail addition. Oops, I should move it here. Yeah, I'm going to move it to the origin and then I'm going to put on it, I'm going to do the tip to tail addition of my vector V plus W, which is this vector. So I'm once more just going to move this and place it here. So we can see here that, um, I guess I should erase the rest of this stuff. Yeah, so I did tip to tail addition and we can see that the vector that connects them is this vector right here that goes, it goes beyond V and then it goes twice V and it connects them like so. So we can see here from tip to tail addition that this is the vector um, to V. And so that is it for number eight.